authorities have banned flights from Wuhan, China to the Philippines indefinitely in order to prevent the novel coronavirus from invading the country. Tourists from Wuhan who arrived in Kalibo on Thursday will be sent back to China. Maria Fernandez has the story. Transportation officials are stepping in to avert the possible entry of the Wuhan coronavirus to the Philippines. The Civil Aeronautics Board, together with the Bureau of Quarantine and airline representatives, have decided to suspend all flights to and from Wuhan, China, indefinitely. Two airlines are currently flying between the Chinese city and the Philippines, Pan Pacific Airline and Royal Air. The suspension of flights between Wuhan and points in the Philippines would be the first step. We will continue to monitor the situation in coordination with the Department of Health regarding the other cities in China. And uh, we will act as may be warranted by, by the situation. Meanwhile, the Civil Aviation Authority of the Philippines, or CAAP, said that passengers who arrived in Kalibo Aklan on Thursday, January 23, will be sent back to Wuhan starting today until tomorrow. CAAP spokesperson Eric Apolonio said they have to check with Royal Air and Pan Pacific Air the exact number of Chinese tourists from Wuhan who arrived in Kalibo. But transport authorities clarify that inbound and outbound flights from other cities in China and countries that have confirmed cases of the new coronavirus have not been halted. What's for sure, though, is that strict screening of passengers will remain in place. They have developed standard practices already in terms of the airline doing screening, doing documentation and uh, other uh, records uh, keeping uh, system. Separately, the health department was able to trace the four family members of a Chinese national who tested positive for the coronavirus. The four boarded Cebu Pacific Flight 5J111, which touched down at Naia Terminal 3 from Hong Kong on Wednesday. The DOH said they're all well. Walang sakit sila. So, wala namang need for us to do any tests on them or to admit them or to hold them in isolation. No other passenger from the same flight was held for further observation. Meanwhile, the Filipina flight attendant who came from Wuhan was already discharged after she was confined for a cough. She placed herself under self-quarantine while the DOH awaits for her test results. For News 5, Ria Fernandez, We Are One News.